mean, it's, it's too early to tell you guys looking at each other. You you don't know. You haven't had time to discuss. Um. Yeah. Not nothing. Nothing that. After being asked about the adjustment of the human body back and forth in space, during a press conference about his one-year mission aboard the space station, NASA's astronaut and former ISS commander Scott Kelly says that aliens handle microgravity better than human astronauts. Just like that, out of nowhere, a high-profile astronaut admits the existence of extraterrestrials, during an official interview. Andrew Zajak, and he's wondering what is uh, was it more difficult mentally or physically adjusting to your year in space? Adjusting to space is easier than adjusting to Earth for me. Um, you know, you do feel a little. You don't. You don't feel. I, I don't think I ever felt completely normal um, up there. There's always some little subtlety of how you're feeling, even after you've been up there for 340 days. Um, but yeah, I f think coming back to gravity is harder than leaving gravity. So I don't know, maybe the aliens got it a lot easier than we do. Um, another interesting one. Um... And it doesn't end here. While addressing the use of virtual reality technology to perform extravehicular activities in space, Kelly also says he trained in a 3D simulator of an alien armada attacking and taking over the ISS during his last mission. Now that's a lot of alien mentions for an astronaut to say during a press conference, especially a high profile one, and they didn't sound accidental either. Otherwise, NASA would have let them off the final edition of the interview. If they let them pass, definitely is because they wanted. But if you ask me, it looks more like a preparation for a massive false flag alien invasion to me than for an actual disclosure. Great, but not only this this device, but just the the technology just, in general has got great uh, potential for applications, not only in space, but of course on Earth as well. As far as it messing with you uh, vestibularly, it actually has a game on it where you, uh, it has like alien spaceships coming inside the space station and there's these like aliens attacking you. You gotta, you gotta shoot them with your finger and we were playing around with that a little bit too and that didn't seem to make anyone sick. It was kind of fun. Okay, next up Irene Claude from Reuters.